Hey, so what is going on everyone? Got another video to share with all of you on how to delete or remove this media not found pop-up from within the GoPro Quick Desktop application. I'm using a Windows 10 computer to make this video for you guys. So if you're getting this pop-up, it is probably because you've either moved your video files to another directory or even deleted them and they kind of become grayed out looking there. So when you click on them, it's giving you this message, which I keep getting. I do a lot of YouTube videos, so I'm constantly moving files around and I wanna clean this up. So let me show you what's going on on here. What I did to make this easy was create a folder on the desktop called videos here and I set GoPro quick to scan that folder. So if I open that it's empty and that's why I'm getting that message because it can't find the video files in there. The other thing I did was move them over to a folder called temp just to show you these files still exist but I moved them to another folder. So what I want to do is just I'm going to move them back just to show you what happens. I'm gonna paste them into the videos folder and then I'm gonna go ahead and close out of the application. I'm gonna reopen the application up and now it's able to scan the videos folder right here because I put the files back and you can see they're lightened up and now if I select them, I have the option here to delete them up here in the corner individually even. So I can select either one there and delete. Okay, now it recognizes, hey, the files are back here. I can work with those files. So. Let's go ahead and click back to media. I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of these one more time. We gotta go through that process because I wanna show you how to get rid of that media not found thing. If I click on them right now, it's gonna start that again because I took them out of that folder. See, that's what happens. The folder is now empty. So if you go into this little button up here, it says add media, then come down here where it says manage folders in settings, click that. Sometimes you can highlight the folder that you have the program here set to scan. And it if you click scan, it will rescan this folder, you know, and see that there's nothing there and that sometimes if you click back it fixes that so if that doesn't work for you just in that go back into that same spot make sure you highlight the one that you have it set to scan and just click this little X and that basically is going to just remove the folder from within the GoPro quick app that will not delete your media that's actually in this folder so we have nothing to worry about anyway because there's no media in there but I'm gonna click remove folder and I'm just gonna add the folder again so just, I'm gonna browse back to my desktop, choose the videos folder, which is right here. That adds it back in. And if I click back, I'm all back to brand new. See, so if I go in this temp folder now and I paste those videos back into that videos folder and I go click add media and go to manage folder settings and click scan, it's going to do a little thingy up here at the top. And if we click back, it's going to add those files right back in like new again. So that's one way for you to clean that up. And if that still doesn't work, and like I said, sometimes you have to close the program, reopen the program to get it to acknowledge what you're doing. When you're working with files like this, you can actually go in, let me show you another place, go into your user account. Now, some of you may not have this app data thing showing. And if you don't, just click view. I'm on a Windows 10 computer, so this little task bar thing's gonna be different for those of you who have different operating system. But I'm gonna click options, and the idea here is to click view, and you wanna show hidden files and folders, and then click apply. That will open up this thing that's kind of grayed out that says app data. So if I click that, I can go in there, go to local, go to where it says GoPro, and then go to cache. See it creates a bunch of cache and you can actually delete all of that if you are still getting stuff you know loaded in here so let's close out of it i'll go back in and see what it's doing real quick so i'm opening it up again here to see what's happening and see it actually deleted this it caused a lot of issues here so these files are not going to work because ah uh, actually i guess they are basically that cache just takes a snapshot of I believe it's just a JPEG of the files. The files actually still work, but that's not how I want the files in there. So I'm going to remove those. And then what I'm going to do is basically end the video here because that deleted my folder and that took care of it. But that should help you guys clean up your folder and get rid of that pop-up that you're getting that says media not found or whatever. So if you enjoyed this video and you found it somewhat helpful, click the thumbs up button and share the video. And if you can share this on the GoPro forums or share the link or something so it helps other people out who are searching for the video. Thanks a lot for watching guys and I'll see you all next time.